Charlie Peterson began his day the same way he did 15 years ago, with an early morning swim. So, uh, Charlie, how was your morning swim this morning? Absolutely lovely. Beautiful. It's so nice to be back here. All the lovely fresh air with that. Oh, it's, it, it, it's wonderful, I tell you. All this lovely, lovely water. A nice swim, keeping me all fit and strong and healthy. Oh, it's beautiful, mate. Beautiful. Having spent the last 15 years in prison, Charlie is re-entering the world at 43 years of age. With no job, family or qualifications, Charlie is free to spend his day however he wants. With the world he once knew gone, Charlie must get reacquainted with life on the outside. What's the, what's the plan for the rest of the day today? Well, I might, you know, have a little bit of a run, do some push-ups, have a bit of apple pie, world's my oyster, as you can see. Yeah, beautiful. Before he was caught, Charlie took down seven police officers. A two-day hunt ended as Charlie surrendered when he was found at a local cafe. One chef claimed he'd ordered a 15-egg omelette and some toast. Tea, push-ups, and a swim. But life wasn't always so simple for Charlie Peterson. Known as Britain's toughest brawler, Charlie was undefeated on the illegal underground fighting scene. Charlie was famous for never using a weapon during a fight, often allowing his opponents to start with one. Beloved wrestler by day, violent brawler by night. He was such a physical man, he used to do his jerks and press-ups in, uh, in the custody office and they realised potentially he had a very violent man there and his record spoke for itself. He's very bright. There's no doubt about his intellectual ability. He's probably brighter than uh, most of those of us who've locked him up. Some of the things he's done certainly can be classed as evil. But I think uh, he's somewhat of a Jekyll and Hyde character. Despite being adamant he won't return to the fighting scene, Charlie still wears his old wrestling boots. You seem to be getting back into fighting shape. Would you be getting back into the fighting scene? Oh, no, 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 mate. You see... The thing about this is, you've got to keep yourself fit and strong and healthy, but no, no, those fighting days, they're behind me, mate. I'm not going back there at all. I mean, I've made my mistakes, but no, no, no. The fighting life isn't for me now. Swimming, nice sand, some sunshine, oh, yeah. Fit as a butcher's pencil. <laughs> and yet, Charlie still won't allow us to follow him between the hours of 5pm and 1am. What he is doing during this time is still a mystery. <laughs>